The chairman of Yemchem International, a herbal medicine production outfit, Dr. Akintude Ayemi, Ayeni, has urged the government not to see Western medicine as the only means through which the COVID-19 pandemic can be contained. According to him, traditional herbal medicines may eventually provide the big breakthrough necessary to contain the pandemic and other debilitating diseases ravaging the world. Ayeni, who stated this in Lagos, said he is collaborating with the ONI of IFE to come out with a herbal solution to the pandemic. He added that very soon the National Agency for Food and Drug Administration and Control, NAVDAC, would be called upon to come and test this product before putting it on the shelves for use. Now, joining us is the, the founder himself of Yemkem International, Akintunde Ayeni. Thank you very much for joining us. Yep. There have been calls for the federal government to explore herbal option for cure, including uh, the owner of IFA, whom you are collaborating with. Um, as someone who owns herbal medicine production outfit, can you tell us the possibility um, that these herbal options might hold and the feasibility of it? Uh, thank you very, thank you very much. Um, there is every possibility that the other medicine has the capability to cure coronavirus. Because this is not the first time we are going to have this kind of a epidemic in Nigeria. It has happened in the past where we have the cholera epidemic and the and other viral infections. And there are ways our forefathers used to treat it and then get cured. So basically, I believe and I have the every sense of belief that the other medicine has the best solution for the treatment of coronavirus. Okay, so this herbal solution you're talking about, how soon do you intend uh, to call NAVDAG? Because um, time is of the essence if um, uh, we are to uh, consider this uh, part. Uh, well, as soon as possible, we are going to call in NAVDAG. We have a Yemkem International, we have produced a lot of ABAC products, and, uh, which is very, um, very good for humankind and of any health challenges. And uh, we don't just bring out drugs anyhow, because we have a name for ourselves, and uh, we are trying every possibility to make sure that the product is out as soon as possible. We are in the process, and by the time the product, the product is ready, we call in NAVDA for the for certification and the product to be hand. And uh, before we do that, I think it's something we have been doing in the past, because this product has the capability to fight any kind of uh, viral infectious disease in the body. All right, we, we understand your outfit is collaborating with the ONI of IFA on this project. Please throw more light on this partnership and the state, current state of the project. Yeah, well, we, Yemkem International as, a, as an other company of uh, close to 40 years in the practice, and uh, we decided to partner with uh, CAPDC on the office the Oba because uh, we see the KBC as a symbol of tradition, as a symbol of culture, that the, the KBC that has so much belief in the traditional medicine, and is very much passionate about this um, product, so that uh, we can use it to fight this uh, coronavirus in our society, most especially in the world. People practicing herbal medicines are somehow being seen as primitive uh, or fetish. How do you intend to overcome this challenge? I totally disagree with that uh, statement from the any side of the corner because the traditional medicine in Nigeria today has gone beyond that. Gone are those days that uh, we have the traditional medicine that maybe is being fetish or is very primitive, but today. You agree with me that the traditional mixing in Nigeria has gone beyond that in terms of our standardization, the packaging. And besides that, if you see most of the products being produced by Yemkem International, it can compare with any other product in anywhere in the world, in the global market. Because these are the capsule, these are the other products we have in capsule, we have it in liquid, 
and we have it also even blistered back. Because in Nigeria today, Yemkem International is the first ABAC company that we produce ABAC medicine into capsules. Yemkem International is the first ABAC company in Nigeria that will produce ABAC medicine in blister pack, like orthodox drugs. See, our forefathers, that's part of the fact that they don't have the Western education knowledge. Besides, they have the way of giving out their other product to people in terms of the measurement. Because the native intelligence is there. When they give you, even in those days, when they give you about medicine to use, the old man will tell you either you take it in tablespoon or teaspoon. Either you take it before meal or after meal. But because of our colonial mentality towards our own indigenous products, that people don't have so much confidence in our whole indigenous product. That is the way they attack that bad belief. That people that practice urban medicine in Nigeria, maybe they are occultic or they belong, they belong into occultic society or Buddhism and Buddhism and things like that. You see, there is a clear difference between spiritualism and herbalism. And herbalism is so separate from spirituality. So when we are talking of herbal mixing, we are talking of herbalism, which is being practiced all over the world. It's been practiced in UK, it's been practiced in New Zealand, it's been practiced in USA, it's been practiced in all over the world. Even in Germany. In Germany, they, they, they refer the herbal practitioners as herbalists. Right. The, in Britain, they, uh, they address their herbal practitioners as herbalists. But it's only in Nigeria that we look at people that they call them herbalists. Ah, don't go near them. It's because of that colonial mentality. All right. Um, now, I, I think you, you... That, if you go to China today, you see that the Chinese believe so much in their traditional medicine. Why? It's because that is what they believe. And that is why the China is moving faster than any part of the world in traditional medicine. All right, um, because of time, uh, let's quickly chip in this question and hopefully um, um, we'll have time to get all your response. Are you funding the project and what do you expect the federal government to do at this time to facilitate herbal research? Well, the, 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 the fund is personal uh, effort. We are not being funded from any, from any government at all. And that is what we are telling the federal government that they need to look inward into the traditional medicine by funding it. Because it is a project that requires a lot of finance. But besides, because on my own part, I am the international, we are doing everything to make sure that we get this product to the society. Because we believe so much that this, pro this other product is very effective and very potent and has the ability to, to fight the, the coronavirus. All right, thank you very much uh, for joining us on the news and sharing uh, your thoughts. Good luck with the project. Yeah, thank you very much.